Macho Mandalorian is here. Oh, yeah. Hey guys, Django Fed here, hunting down games, comics, TV shows, movies, and more. And this is the fourth and final Daniel Wallace book, The Imperial Handbook. So let me just get right into this book and then break it down to you guys. This book has a very nice glossy black cover with the Imperial Signia. Very, very nice cover. So I'll just open the contents and break it down to you guys. This book is set before the Battle of Yavin and reveals the composition and organization of the Empire's Imperial Army, Navy, and Stormtrooper Corps plus details concerning experimental technology and super weapons. And as always, there are done with comments for the entries and the Rebels comment on the Imperial entries. Uh, a lot of content to wrap your head around and become an arrogant Imperial snob or hate them as much as any Rebel. And this book is just packed to the brim with content. A lot of detail on the troopers, formations, vehicles, Imperial code, and military tactics. I will say that the first and last section of the book are kind of boring and laxing. I did like all the comments made by Luke Skywalker on all the Rebels. It wasn't the best out of all the comments made like the Book of Sith. It was good nonetheless. And this book has the best pictures out of all of the Daniel Wallace books. And the artwork is just phenomenal. I would do wish there were a bit more pictures, especially for the different ships, troopers, formation, squad size, and just a bit more of that stuff. But I still think they did a pretty good job for all the different uh, artwork. This book is extremely detailed with all of the Imperial military tactics. I did like seeing that a lot, a lot in this book. And especially breaking down all of the squads, how many squads, how many troopers per squad, the regiments, the, uh, the Navy, and how they break down how many ships there are. There is just so much to go by and so much to keep you entertained with. So I'm just going to keep it short and sweet. So my final verdict for Star Wars The Imperial Handbook is... It's another great book by Daniel Wallace. Definitely complete your Star Wars collection by getting this book. It's a must. A must for Star Wars fans. And guys, please check out my previous Daniel Wallace book reviews like Book of the Sith, The Jedi Code, and The Bounty Hunter Code. Links will be down below in the description. So that's it for the collection, guys. I'm not planning to do many book reviews in the future. I do want to do more, definitely, but I do have to focus on the Star Wars video game reviews. But uh, the next book review I want to do, I want to focus on, is the Clone Wars Adventure books. There's about 10 of these books, and I'll just do one review of the entire book series. I hope you guys are looking forward to that, and thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to please like and comment down below. Tell me what you think of the Imperial Handbook, if you've read it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel, Django Fett, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.